because, like I said to you once before, I'm an ex-drug dealer. I'm an ex-drug addict. I hated. I got to the point where I saw I was being used, as many of my people are being used, and many other people of different nationalities. Okay, by the powers that be, from a lack of knowledge. That's why we have an article here. I meant to. Uh, we kind of did this impromptu today. I meant to show this article. Maybe I'll, I'll hopefully show it on a previous, on a succeeding show. But it shows here. I just got it out of the Tribune here the other week. Uh, about the middle of uh, May, because uh, we're shooting this on Memorial Day, what they call Memorial Day here, and uh, the 26th of May uh, in 08. But it shows you in this article, it shows the United States Army in Afghanistan walking through a field of poppies. And it tells you in this article that the United States government told these soldiers not to destroy these poppy fields to allow the Afghan farmer to make money. That's what they tell the people, that's propaganda, okay? But the in actuality, and this has been going on now for centuries, all right, that the international bankers and, and the monarchy in England, they are the ones who control these poppy crops, not only in Afghanistan, but in other countries, all right? And they use these poppies that they get the opium from, that heroin comes from, to disseminate amongst the masses of the people, to keep the people drugged down, to keep them where they can't operate at their highest potential. Because if you're not operating at your highest potential, mentally and physically, then you're going to be at a very low ebb spiritually, all right? It's just that simple. So you have to have all three of those working in conjunction at their highest level. And again, you get the spirit from Yah. So when you plug into Yah and shed yourself, disconnect yourself from all forms of idolatry and all forms of adulteration, okay, which drugs are, whether they're legal or illegal, it makes no difference, okay, because all of your big, huge drug factories, Eli Lilly, Smith & Cone, they do the same thing. They just got licensed to do it. All right, and they use a lot of these same illegal drugs in their drugs to keep the people drugged down. So, you know, uh, uh, I could go on, you know, forever, but Mark said we only got so much time today. Uh, but uh, again, you have the number. Feel free to call Yara Righteousness at any time. Uh, if you only have Mark's number, call him. He'll give you the number. Uh, we're available basically 24-7 because even on the Sabbath day we take calls from people uh, who call, who want to discuss Yah, Yah righteousness, Yah host, and the situation that we're in. Okay, so uh, don't be inhibited, don't be apprehensive, don't be afraid. Uh, like I said, we, we, we have access to all people. Uh, it's about all people. It's about bringing this world under the banner of Yah, our righteousness, under the banner of the true creator, and so that the whole world can live in peace, truth, and righteousness. So, you know, Yah bless audience and peace, and hopefully we'll speak again in the near future. Yah bless.